you're going to come down lower and lower. What is important is I want you to just keep your ideas, uh, this on your mind clear uh, in terms of, okay, getting insights. How does it work for you? Don't look at immediate solutions. Okay, can I do it immediately? No. This is where I think uh, probably we'll have another technology summit where we we'll look at, get down a little more detail and look at how can you use IT enabled services or you can look at technology summit for data analytics. We'll get into specific areas, but this is more generic in nature to give you, uh, to trigger the thought process. Now there can be two types of uh, ways you can look at information. One is to be reactive, look at when it comes, dekha jayega, or the other thing is to be proactive. Now all the ideas, all the presentations here are focused on the proactive perspective. If you remember this uh, serial, Babu was talking about artificial intelligence, about Ramayana or Mahabharata. Now there are devas and asuras uh, who become invisible. Now the traditional physical arrows other things won't work. So Arjuna had to go to the devas and then he has to pray and then he gets special weapons. Now if you look at the power of the special weapons, they're much ahead of the drones in terms of the thought process. Now you just take that particular special motion, he has a special uh, tool which has got the arrow, not only that, he chants the mantra, which means he's communicating what he, what he wants from that particular special weapon, and the special weapon will go pursue that fellow wherever he is and ensure that he's killed. <laughs> okay, so the thought process of ours was much ahead of the drones which are now coming in now. In the case of drones, at least you have to code. Here, there is no coding. Automatically, from thought process to the physical process. Now, that's where say, they say digitization, we are moving from, what is it? Atoms to bits and bytes. And all this is to trigger the thought process.